Today, Americans, we're talking about the Sowall. That is all right. This particular model is just pretty simple. You'll have your two tools. Part of the tool will have a screwdriver. That's for taking your your um, your string out, your spool of string. That's wax string. You can buy this on Amazon. Um, I bought mine from a local leather shop here, but you can buy it on Amazon. I think even eBay had it. Uh, that's your your tool there. You just pop it open. There you are. Place your needle, which is sharp, right there. Pop this through. And I always like to snug it up just a tish. Nothing much. That's it. And that's the little tool. The reason I like this, this particular model is because you can store everything right in the handle. Which is nice because even if I'm backpacking or whatnot, I, I throw that in. If you have a pack, go down or whatever. The string, pretty heavy duty stuff. Waxed string. Um, I bought that off of Amazon. It was quite a bit cheaper um, through Amazon. And um, that's what you have. You just pop it through. All right, I pulled out enough string off your spool to come across and over and maybe just an inch or two um, extra. So that's what you do. And that's what it'll look like. Okay. <clears throat> Take your saw and push through. Pull your excess, okay, wrong side, out through the hole that you just punched. And I'm just going to pull a little extra. There we go. And I'll pull back through, and that's what you have, okay? At this point, that's all this is. Come through, and normally I can make this happen quite a bit faster, but for the sake of the video, This is going to take a little extra long. There we go. You got your first stitch. And like I said, after this process goes, generally speaking, I can make this really happen pretty quickly. Pop it through. Now, if you pop it through one side, it actually is a bad thing. So you want to make sure you're propping it through the opposite side that's connected to this. So if I tighten this up, you can see which side's sucking through. You don't want to stick it through that side. Stick it through this side right here. Otherwise, it'll turn into a knot. And believe me, I've done that about 700 times. Can you see what I'm doing here yet? One, two, three, three stitches. And one of these sewalls will last you years, if not decades. Um, I have had nothing but good to say about my sewall. I, I wish I would have had one 10 years. Prior. This one's probably four years old, maybe, and it's still an A1 shape. You can buy replacement needles for these, etc. Now, when you're sewing, don't worry about all that. You can trim that off later. That's not a big deal. So, this is what the other side looks like, and all I'm doing is just stitching it through. Works great. Like I said, wax string. You have to use wax string, but... What I'm making right now is a waste basket for um, for uh, my semi. Now I want to show you a little trick that took me a long time to learn. As you can see, if I pull this out, this moves. The, spit, the spool moves, okay? And then I can just roll it back up. Now. This will save you a lot of headache, and I wish there was a YouTube video back when I first started this. 
um, that kind of taught me this. Pop it through, okay? And you don't even have to go that far down on the needle and pull it back. Now, like I said, if I put it through this side here, it's gonna turn into a knot. If I turn it through this side here, it's gonna turn out like a beautiful stitch, that stitching process, okay? But if I take the spool, my finger, my thumb, and just, now watch right here, if you will. Um, let's see here. Watch this piece right here. See how that moved in? Then I know to loop it through here. So it makes your process go a lot faster. And um, you'll, you'll, um, you'll want to give me a kiss next time you see me, even though that that wouldn't be appropriate. Male or female, I am happily married. Most 100% of the time. Just want to take a minute while I'm putting the finishing stitches here. Um, thank you for watching the channel. And I, I hope that, um, you know, what I'm doing here is, um, is helping you. Um, please subscribe to the channel. And um, any comments that you have, keep them clean. Put them in the, the description box. Um, and uh, I'd appreciate that if you have any tips on this. Um, and make sure to hit the like button. Hit the thumbs up, that really helps us out. Just tighten that up, see how I did that? And you probably at this point already clicked off the channel because you're thinking, dude, I'm not, I'm not um, mentally slow. I can figure this out now. And it's not, it's not hard. Um, I sure have had a lot of people over the years ask me, how do you use the dumb thing? So this is what has made the video uh, come together. I dedicate this video to John. He asked me to do a video on this, and uh, I told him next time I had a project come up, I would surely make him one. Dedicated to John the Beloved. Well, I don't think it's the same John. But... Thank you, Americans, for watching. Great American Sewall. Just punch in Sewall to Amazon. And like I said, I'll try to put a description link below. Good to go. Trim your work. I'll singe that. This video, like I said, was dedicated to John, who is a subscriber. If you have anything, or you hear me reference to something, and you would like to know more details, I would like to accommodate that eventually. You know, let's burn those edges off. There you go.